We are about to embark upon a series of strange and exciting, dangerous adventures. Adventures that will lead us to all parts of the world. Hello and welcome to another Bad Comic Review. This time we're looking at The Batman and Scooby-Doo Mysteries Issue 1. This is a 12-issue limited series from DC Comics from 2021. Written by Ivan Cohen. Art and cover by Dario Brasilia. Colors by Franco Risco. Letters by Sadia Temofonte. And by Michael McAllister. Quality's pretty decent. St off to a good start so far. Batman has summoned Mystery Inc. to help him solve the mystery of an exhibit of Batman stuff that's been tampered with somebody has stolen his original gloves the worst part is he can't remember what happened to them he knows he retired them at some point because he only used them on his first few cases but he can't remember what happened to him after that and robin isn't able to track down any information either so it looks like the incident may have happened in the bat cave which is really suspicious so you know what that means shaggy velma and scooby have to go back in time meanwhile fred daphne and batman are in the present trying to load the gloves and do various other things robin's helping as well well when the trio goes back in time they run into alfred and they quickly discover that something interesting is going on with batman at the time and daphne fred and batman figure out that there's uh, some sort of compartment hidden in the museum so we do find out a resolution to this and it's kind of cool to see the old batman costume but the bat on his chest looks a little weird other than that i thought the art was just fine it really captures the scooby do feel you get scooby going after a scooby snack you've got all sorts of goofy craziness going on no real monsters per se but an interesting little mystery that was worth reading it's a fun book it's very fast paced they do a lot of stuff in here and it was cool to see batman and robin treated with respect this was an old style comic book where it was made for all ages and can easily appeal to younger readers and older readers if you were a scooby doo fan as a kid you'll get something out of this if you're a batman fan as a a kid you'll also get something out of this i thought it was a lot of fun and it was better than all of the future state stuff for less price so for three bucks this is easily a recommendation so if you get a chance to check it out absolutely do so this was a fun read if you know someone that wants to get into comics and they want to read some batman or scooby-doo this is for them so worth picking up for someone you know or yourself i think adults will enjoy it just fine it's a nice simple mystery but it was a lot of fun at the same time had that kind of goofy set 70s flair that is really missing from cartoons and comics very well written very fun adventure definitely worth the price that'll do it for this one thank you so much for listening and supporting the channel if you enjoyed the video please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss future reviews if you'd like to help the channel out in other ways pick yourself something up from the teespring store donate monthly on patreon or send me a stream labs which is just a paypal donation it's very easy and it's greatly appreciated and as always we hope to see you on the next one.